Recovering from a wild weekend at the Balloons, Tunes, and Barbecue Festival where Bowling Green Idol 3 took place Friday night. What a night it was. We have a new Bowling Green Idol champion. It is Shara Lawrence, and she's in the studio with us. Hello, Shara. Hey. How you doing? I'm doing good. Now, okay, it has been a, um, I know it was a wild night Friday night. Take us through uh, your experience at Bowling Green Idol Friday. What was it like getting there and the, you know, the first song and the second song? What was your first song that you did on Friday night? My first song that I sang was um, Aretha Franklin, Chain of Fools, and it was a lot of fun, and I was nervous about how I might perform it because I'm not so much of a performer, Right. but um, I had a good time with it. I had a lot of fun up there on stage singing that song. Right. Now, after you, so so you went up there, you sang, you had a big cheering section there for you. Yeah. Everybody came out to support you, and uh, after you did that first song, what was it like? Was it like a moment of relief? Did you think you might have made it to the second round? How, critique your first song performance. We know what the judges obviously thought about it, but what did you think about your first song that you sang on stage? I was relieved when I got done with that song because <laughs> the first time that I sang it all the way through nonstop without messing up yeah. was about 20 minutes before I came to <laughs> the balloon tunes and barbecue. So I was a little nervous, um, but everything went okay. And I walked right. off stage with complete relief, like a burden had been lifted. So. Did you, did you know you had nailed it when you walked off? I didn't know I nailed it, but I thought I'd I thought I did the best I could. Right, right. Now, I, well, I, the, the the crowd thought you had nailed it, obviously, when you <laughs> went off. Now, okay, so we make the cut to the top five. You make it to the top five. And um, so then you automatically start thinking, okay, I got to do another song. Now, tell the folks what the second song that you uh, sang on stage was. The second song that I sang um, yeah. was one of my favorite songs in the world. It's called Redeemer, and it's sang mm-hmm. by Nicole Simone, and it's right. a contemporary Christian song. Right. Now, and of course, uh, that's the thing, too, when you... Uh, when you did that song, you dedicated it to the family that yes. was there and stuff. That was so sweet. That was so touching. You almost started crying on stage. I know. I can't help it. Uh, yeah, I'm was, a sucker. <laughs> yeah, that was some good brownie points there with the judges. But anyway, no, it was actually, it was really, really great. We talked to one of the judges after the competition. They said they had chill bumps on their arms while you were singing. That, wow. Uh, hands down, just an amazing performance there. And uh, just an amazing night. Uh, by the way, we're talking to Cheryl Lawrence. She won Bowling Green Idol 3. And you can see the video and pictures from the night at our website. It's BowlingGreenSam.com. Um, wow. So have you got a chance to go back and watch the video and everything on the website? Yeah, I, I watched Critique it. Critique your performance a little bit there? Yeah. yeah. I, I hate hearing myself. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. I guess it's just the... I don't know, right. phobia or whatever. I don't know. Wow. So so what about the rest of the weekend? I mean, did you have to take a lot of phone calls and tell a lot of people the story and oh all that stuff? Oh, my gosh. I could not get off my phone Friday night. <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, I'm, I was at the church all day Saturday because right. we're getting ready for this thing. But I, when I got out to my car, it was like, yeah. So many missed calls, this many right. voicemails, new text messages. I'm like, God. <laughs> See, you're the, you're the Bowling Green Idol now. It's good to go. Well, I guess the next stop for you, you're going to be recording with Darren Doyle in yes. Studio DD. I'm really excited about that. What, so what what are you thinking about? What kind of music do you want to record? Do you want to, do you want to do some of your own stuff? Do you want to remake some songs? What are you thinking about you might want to work with him in the studio on? Well, since because of my faith, it will probably yeah. be more of Christian sound or yes. contemporary Christian music. Right. Um, that's what I really want to pursue if I were to pursue anything. Um, right. So well, I've cool. got some things in mind. I'm not really sure yet, but right. we'll see. Well, and another thing you want to do, you want a, a free massage from uh, Heartland Massage. Thank I, God. I, I, I was going to say that will probably be one that will get used before any of the other ones oh, I've yeah. had, right? Yeah. need to get some of the attention out. Well, it was an awesome night, Shara. You, I did get some free smoothies already. <laughs> yeah, I was going, there you go. Yeah, Planet Smoothie stepped up big time. and they, I mean, everybody there was hopped up on Planet Smoothie all night. It was great, man. It was awesome stuff. So, yeah, so there you also got a beautiful gift basket from, from Planet Smoothie. Gorgeous. Loaded with stuff. Seriously, a couple hundred bucks worth of stuff in there. Well, Shara, you did great. We are so happy uh, that that you won, and uh, like I said, you definitely, uh, you definitely, uh, you are what this competition is all about: finding talent right here in Southern Kentucky who can go to the next level with it. So we wish you best of luck. Thank you. We got a feeling that we're going to be playing your music on the radio before too much longer. You're that you're that good, and uh, I know Darren uh, Darren Doyle is excited to be working with you in the studio recording your album. Woo! 
Woo! Oh, getting all the headshots made with Wes Davis photography and the tro. What do you got, what do you got with the trophy that you got from Thompson's Trophy Center? What, what are you, you going to do with it? Where is it going to be at in your house? Um, probably on the wall somewhere. I, I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's got to clear a space for it. It's still it's still letting a lot of it sink in and everything. Hey, you can go to our website. It's www.bowlinggreensam.com. It's Cheryl Lawrence, our new Bowling Green Idol. She won Friday night at the Balloons, Tunes, and Barbecue. Uh, festival Bowling Green Idol 3. You can see all the video and all the pictures right there at BowlingGreenSam.com. Anybody you want to say thanks to for coming out or showing you support through all this? Just thank you to all my family and friends. I would name names, but I know I'd forget somebody. So, <laughs> Well, very, very cool. Well, we look forward to seeing you back. Ne- you going to come back next year and sing for us at Bowling Green Idol 4? Well, you know it. All right, we can't wait. It's Cheryl Lawrence, folks. Congratulations to her. Make sure you check out our website. It's www.BowlingGreenSam.com.